cool and gentlemen, welcome back to Dark Cloud. Once again, me, the Lonesome Routers. Guys and guys, we can continue to kick off with our little adventure by, you guessed it, headed straight back into Divine Beast Cave. I will actually have a quick double check to make sure everything is all okay. Um, yeah, I am pretty damn satisfied. Our weapons are looking pretty good. We have an absolute shite ton of repair powder and we are all good to go. Alrighty, sweet. I Just so everyone actually knows, it is getting fucking toasty in my room right now. I've been recording for about, like... Uh, apparently an hour and ten minutes so far, so it's been uh, pretty damn intense. Divine Beast Cave. Divine Beast Cave. So hopefully, I think, I imagine after this episode, I most likely will stop, because if not, I'm probably going to die of dehydration. Anyway, I'm going to really steal a touch of Lucas before we start this episode. When I say before we start this episode, more like just after we, uh, just after we start this episode, but anyway. Okay, so floor 14. I still actually have no idea how many floors we're actually expecting to have on this game, like as in per dungeon, but... We will presumably find out. Okay. Oh, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> Sorry, for some reason I pressed triangle to lock on. Okay. Come on, rockin' off. What do you want? When do we want it? Holy shit, he is catching up. Holy fuck. There we are, okay. Nope. Come on. Oh, bugger off, rockin' off. I ain't playing your games. Okay. Um, sweet. It's the bone key. Awesome. That's actually, to be fair, a very good thing to find quite early on. Doesn't mean we're going to find that door and be, like, stuck there for a bit. Okay, Mr. Ghost. Alright, so, I saw you bastards over there, and there's actually two of you. So that definitely means both of you aren't get oh. Go on. Yep. I'm sorry, my friend. I actually saw that coming this time. And I finished you off like an absolute champ as well, so what are you going to do this time? Alright, so I am not going to kid. I am kind of a little bit scared to actually be doing these this time. So, let's have a nice little volunteer to roll on up. Alright, Bella. Alright, you get the first one. Bella, you fucked up! <laughs> Please don't. Oh, for bloody old Bella. What did you do that for? You messed up, you silly Billy. Oh, well. I I, I think from now on, I'm, I'm going to try and avoid them. There's, they haven't really done me too well like, recently. I mean, the, the first couple did me really, really good. I got pumped with, uh, pumped with stamina both times. I think one time I actually got like my. I was something happened at one point. Like, I got my WHS like increased at one point. I don't know. I, yeah, that was one. It? Yeah, my WHS increased like uh, its maximum increased. So, um, I mean that was quite cool. But uh, of course Bella had to ruin the run. God damn it, Bella! All right, Laura's house. Laura's house. Wow, I forgot even Laura existed. Who is Laura? I don't even know. Anyway, um, okay. Bone key. Alrighty. Hello, Mr. Bat. Oh no, it's the bat. He's full of stamina. That actually did a decent amount of damage. Oh, sick! Nice. Thank you, Mr. Bat. You've helped me. Um, okay. Uh, yeah, I'm satisfied with that. Am I, am I satisfied with that, though? Like, yeah, 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 I'm satisfied with that. Why not? Go, on. Go crazy! Sweet. 25. Nice. Uh, build up. Can we? Can't do that yet. Oh, our insurance. Oh! Eh uh, I forgot about all of this. Ah, uh, yeah, of course. I, I keep thinking you just have to level up to a certain point to actually build up stuff, but of course, yeah, I, that's a bloody silly move of me. So, we need to focus on endurance. Actually, I, I wanted this one, because I mean, that, this one looks like it's too simple, just like that by itself, whereas this one, it's not like a bit of everything, so I'm. Oh, wait, what? Mimic killer? Oh, Christ, I'm finding a mimic killer thing. Okay, um. Attack, endurance, and magic power. Okay. And magic power. Okay, so, well, magic power is looking damn good. Pop that there. Is that enough? That's not including that, is it not? Did I not put it there? I did. It, I, 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 maybe it doesn't include it until I actually leveled up or anything like that at all. Um, okay, so what do we have to do for that one? Sorry. So it was uh, attack, endurance, magic power, uh, thunder, and mimic. Attack, endurance, magic power, thunder, and mimic. Oh, oh holy shit, I got a lot of stuff in. <laughs> I didn't expect that, then, I have to admit. Um, okay, so attack, endurance, magic power. I think, to be fair, just to be. Oh, <sighs> Wasted again! For now, just just because I'm a cool like that, I'm going to do that. Um, okay. I really probably should have been focusing on that. I didn't really think about that, I have to admit. I kind of forgot that you had to fulfill certain things to actually make it go up that way, but oh well. Well, like, what I could do is actually... Uh, I could use the power-up powder. I mean, I've got some. I don't really just really need it, like, any time in the future. I just picked up some cheese, which is actually really good luck. 
I tell you what, actually, I, I generally really prove the uh, the rumor of like, you know how you supposedly when you eat cheese and you go to bed, that apparently like you men are like, like have really bad nightmares. I ate like a slab of cheese last night before going to bed, like literally just before I went to bed. Sometimes I just really crave some Craven uh, ca Cathedral cheese, which is the best cheese in England. I'm not gonna lie. Um, <laughs> this this episode is not sponsored by Cathedral cheese. Um, <laughs> um, but it is beyond, without a doubt, the most fantastic cheese ever. I had actually quite a lot of that last night. Just like, just literally just sat there munching away on it. And, uh, oh, fuck it, let's go for it. And, um, yeah, I literally went to bed straight afterwards. Nothing bad happened, so I'm, uh, quite surprised. Anyway, so yeah, so status break is something we can do at one point. Obviously, like we said before, that's basically something we can kind of, like, break down to put into better weapons. But as we really don't have too much right now, we don't really need to worry about that as such if it makes sense so yeah i mean one of the things i uh i do probably need to do something about that is that with the quench ability there um can we actually just like see what that is i can't like i, I think quench helps you holy moly oh of course there's extra damage benefit against water i think quench like helps you just like stop reducing your health or your first quite uh, quickly um but yeah, so basically, like, um, what we might do later on is we might actually build that level up, this uh, this knife up to, like, level 5, just simply be able to then break it down to pop it into a better weapon, um, to sort of make the most prime weapon we can for, our, obviously, our hero, to be fair, because obviously he, he will most likely be the most predominant one we will actually use. But um, as we basically can kind of build this up, and we will, um, we may as well kind of focus on that for now. So, um, oh, sweet. So it's literally just endurance now for that. Nice. Endurance, thunder, and mimic still. Okay, nice. So... Um, Endurance by two, and we'll go some thunder. Nice. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Alrighty. So, it's not a mimic killer. I, I mean, I don't expect to get one like two seconds then, but I'm wondering how we'll actually get around to getting any of them. To be fair. But anyway. Okay. Mr. Chest, mimic killer. <laughs> okay. To be fair, we actually—I I don't actually know how much of them mimic killer things we actually need as well. So, it could be a pain. <laughs> Dran's horn. Oh, sweet. So that's the last part of Dran's thing jig. Nice. Okay. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, there we are. Perfect. Okay. It's kind of panicked for a sec then. I was like, no. All right. Jump. All right. Page. Page. Finally. Fucking hell. Page. You took long enough to be popped out of these bloody balls, didn't you? It's like Gatchums with you. Okay. Ah. Ah. Well, I, I, got, I took him down anyway. Okay. You know what? Bella, you can have this one. Being so cool with your horns. Come on, Mr. Big Boy. You're going down. Are you like random magic power or something like that? You're just like horning me. Oh, no, mind. There you go. Are you feeling a bit horny, baby? Are you feeling horny, dragon? I'm fucking right in the nostril. Look at that. It's right in the nostril. It's beautiful. Okay, come on. Perfect. That's actually perfect. Nice. Good job, Bella. That's actually beautiful. Okay, so. um, Yeah, nice. Uh, ooh, I'm trying to strategically plan this out now. It's going to, like, spam myself and run around too much. I'm going to go up here first, because then we can come back down, do the rest of the section, and pop straight to the exit straight away. Nice. Okay. Do actually swap over to Booker as well, just to kind of be a bit more savey safe, I guess. Um, sweet. Nice, nice. Okay. I, I'm trying to think of exactly what I was talking about before. I just got a bit distracted by the dragon just then. I think I was talking about cheese. I'm pretty sure I was talking about cheese before. Anyway, but yeah, no, I, I basically ate a bunch of cheese and didn't have no nightmares at all. I was actually generally worried about that as, as I was eating it. I was like, oh shit, I should have probably thought about that before I started to eat this stuff. But I fucking, I love cheese. I recently, I tried out cheese and strawberries for the, same, for the first time, like together. Like literally like having them on top of each other and then munching away on them. They are so nice. I've never tried it before and it's so generally so nice. I mean, I've always been a huge fan of like, Mixing kind of acidic fruits with cheese. Like, say, for example, I always used to love pineapple and cheese a lot of the time. Who the hell's Carl? Ah, I don't really mind. Okay. Ah! Oh, shit. Okay. Whoo! That was a risky, risky, bisky move, that was. I was kind of taking a lot of damage from little points there. Okay, so we're going to repair this now anyway. Thank you very much, Mr. Base Lord. Um, let's just eat a bit of bread to be safe. Uh, we'll heal up to, no, um, for, so have a, or for a Fimmy Jig as well. Hello, Mr. Dragoon. Okay. Ha, he, ha, he, ha. Okay, perfect, nice. Okay. Still no tram court oil. Tram, tram court? Tram cart oil at all. It's kind of a shame, because I mean, I, I don't think I've actually managed to do, go uh, back to one of them yet in this, like, in this Let's Play as such, so it's a bit of a shame. Okay. I oh, never know, hopefully. Oh, wow, hey, it's finally broken. That's actually. 
I, I, I sound a bit happy about that. It's kind of a shame because we're going to have to get use new one, but I'm quite happy that's actually working as such, if it makes sense. I was kind of worried it's a bit glitched out and it's going to stick there the entire time, but sweet. Nice. Okay. So I've got one more piece of Atla, a couple more enemies, and a chest. Beautiful. Oh, for God's sake, Mr. Bat. Why are you pumped up as well? You shouldn't be pumped up. You should be depressed. Okay. Lamp. Beautiful. Uh, hello, Mr. Oh, maybe there's 15 floors. That would entirely make sense. That would entirely make sense. There might be 15 floors. That would make sense. Okay, I'm 100% sure the next floor is actually going to be the last one as well. Nice. I sound... <laughs> that was really weird. It's like, nice. Sweet. That's actually really quite cool. I, I really did not expect that. Okay. Um, hello, Mr. Ghost. Time to die, Mr. Ghost. Die, Mr. Ghost. <laughs> Spooky. Okay. Perfect. All right. Uh, you're still doing, like, bugger all damage, Mr. Bat. Perfect. Okay. Awesome. What a way to end the floor. Okay. I think I'm actually so confident that the next floor is actually going to be nothing there at all. I'm gonna go ahead and go to the next floor. I've got a load of power break and repair powder if I am actually wrong. And I, like, I'm actually only 10 minutes into this, into this episode too, so I'm not doing too bad. Okay. I'm like 49% sure this is going to be like... Actually, no, I, I call it about I call it like 80% sure this is going to be like the actual the final floor. We'll tell basically if it looks a lot differently than it actually does normally. So, to the next floor... Yay, this is the next floor. This is the, this is the boss level. Nice. I did actually genuinely not expect to get to this floor that soon, I have to admit. Hello, Mr. Transdoor. I don't think we can do anything yet. There's a horn-shaped keyhole. Use item with square. Okay, so basically right now... <laughs> I love the top there. Floor. Boss. Um, but yeah, so basically it's kind of saying we have to use a can of a key to get through here. And we do not have anything that would really fit the bill for that as such. Unless you want some repair powder. <laughs> Just that, Booker. Okay, nice. So, let's return to the top. Good old Fairy King, give us a little uh, opt out there. Nice, back to Nolan Village. So, if you guys and guys can't really put like one on one together right now, basically, there's kind of like a clear kind of option as to what we have to kind of do now. Um, as we just received Dran's Horn to kind of finish the final piece of Dran Windmill. Uh, basically, that's the last thing we have to do. We have to simply pop this onto Shaw. Uh, where are you, Mr. Dran's Horn? Oh, there we are. I'm pretty sure the hag is there. Or well, the mayor's there. I'm not too sure, but we'll go find out anyway. Okay. Hey, there we are. Okay. Look at that lovely panoramic shot. Ah. It's so beautiful. My life's work is coming to an end. The power of Dran is restored. I actually am not... Oh, what? Really? I thought someone gave us the key. Wait, seriously? It just, it just sat there? Oh, that's a bit of a... Well, it's not that bad, but I expected to at least be handed it in a polite manner. Well, I, don't, I generally did not expect that. That's actually not too bad. Okay. <laughs> I thought it was going to be like a cutscene, and then like the mayor would be like, Jordan, I've been holding this for ages. Well, not Jordan. It would be quite strange if he actually said Jordan, because it would be quite creepy. But, um... Well, there you go. So you finished off Dran's windmill. It's looking very, very snazzy, and it's a uh, nice little pick of piece of technology. Anyway, so yeah, so that's just yeah, that's really about it, really. To be fair with that, there's nothing too much else. I, I, I swear, I remember there being like some kind of cutscene, but yeah, oh well. Anyway, so um, we may as well kind of finish off the rest. Actually, let's move away from here quickly because I can still hear that. Can I? I can still hear the windmill. I, I don't know if my headphones gone weird. Hang on a sec. Hang on. I have gone the wrong way around, but yeah, I can actually still hear the cogs of the windmill turn around. But we're gonna we're gonna let the game do its stuff with that one. That's fine. Okay, so uh, it's Laura's house. Yes, yeah, the last one down. No, of course not. It's at the top. Laura, Laura. Okay. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Hey, there we are. Sweet. Um, let's config and assembly the little itty bitty stuff at the bottom here. Uh, a river. Nice. Okay. Uh, Hold back the river, let me look in your eyes. Okay. Um, look at that beauty. We're going to have an island in the middle where we're going to just pop oh, oh, a gaffer <laughs> by himself. <laughs> okay. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Oh, shit, I picked up a gaffer. Um, oh, no, hang on, hang on. Gaffer, there you go. Sorry about that, gaffer. Okay. Uh, we'll pop some trees there. There you go, beautiful. All right, so. Um, do we not have any roads? Seriously? Wow, I, did, I expect to pick up a couple more roads then. But anyway, um, okay, Alnut's house, uh, Carl. Hey, Alnut's baby brother, baby brother, Alnut, Alnut, where's your baby brother? Hello, Alnut's brother, Carl. Hey, Booker, bro, 
Booker bro. <laughs> what kind of name is that? I don't know. Anyway, Booker bro. I don't think they intended for the uh, alliteration there. Anyway, um, I got that word right. It is alliteration. Anyway, um, you're in one piece. I thought you were dead. Oh, cheers, gal. Very morbid. Anyway, um, tell me how I should rebuild your house. Uh, I'd like my storage cabin with my treasures inside. Treasures inside? Jesus Christ. What, you, geez, it's like, it's, it's, I think this might be, um... Is it Gadget? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, it's a yeah, Gadget from... Well, it's not It's not Gadget from Indiana Jones, but the same actor that plays Gadget in uh, Goonies is that guy. Yeah, I think... Uh, what's that guy's name? I can't even think what the kid's name is called now. I don't know. Anyway. Um, let's have a double check. There's no items. Any items around here at all? No? Okay. Wait, is it, is it the kid? Is it the kid that gives us the... I don't even know. Someone, someone gives us a... Um, Someone here, someone somewhere, gives us a fishing rod, and I have no idea who. It might be the kid that gives us a fishing rod now. I, I generally have no idea. I'm really trying to think. I'm kind of hoping this kid would be very, very simple if it is the kid, but we'll find out. Anyway. Hello, what's the event going on here to betroth my honor? <gasps> ah, Booker, there you are. How convenient, you just finished our house. I found this bed here. You want to give it a go? I mean, she, she's... I'm sorry, but for a Carson Garrett, she's pretty hot. Anyway, um, I keep my promises. Just a moment. I can't remember what the promise was, but if you are going to get naked for me, love, I will truly accept that promise. She's... I don't know why. She's really like, quite a little hot character for, like, a, a, like, an animated character. Why are my feet so big? They're huge. Okay. Here. I, boom! I knew it was summer. I, yeah, this is the kid's fishing rod. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. A fishing rod, as I promised. I can't remember her saying that, but I imagine I could have asked her and asked her about it, but anyway. Fishing rod, and then the kid comes in. I got this from Uncle Pike, but I don't really use it. Now it's yours. Hey, don't tell uh, uh, Uncle Pike, okay? How do you use it? I don't really know, sorry. Aw, oh, sis, that's not fair. Okay, so maybe the kid wanted it? I'm not too sure. Didn't I tell you I always wanted that? I don't know why I'm doing voices. <laughs> what are you talking about? You almost drowned at the pond once, remember? I'm not allowing you to fish. It's too dangerous. What the? What the fuck, you bitch? <laughs> That's not fair. Wow, wow, wow. Book is so stunned, he's just gonna take the fishing rod for himself. Okay. Sweet, so we actually have a fishing rod now. Nice. Hopefully, I'll be able to show you guys a bit more on what exactly that is. Uh, Dino Slayer. Okay. I have a feeling that might be worth, like, maybe saving on, like, oh. Doesn't look like you can climb it. Oh, okay. Okay, I, go, I, go, I was like, I was like what is this? Um, okay, sweet. Cheers for letting me have your stuff. Bye. <laughs> okay. Um, but no, so I think I imagine that. Now thinking about it, I remember the last boss taking a bit of time to do. So I think probably what would be best for actually to be fair as a whole. Um, oh. My sister doesn't like it, the, like the Macho uh, Brothers. I don't know why. They're nice people. Oh, so you don't like to be near them. Okay. The miracle treasure chests appear after you return from the cave. They appear after you ex access new floors. Well, that's what I heard anyway. The miracle chests? Is that what they're called? I didn't never knew that. Okay. Um, sweet. Well, we may as well kind of finish up the houses rather than visit them and then finish them off. Um, Alright, so I think Paige's house really deserves to finish off. Come on, Paige. A pretty girl who grew up with Booker. Now, I'm 100% sure this is the bay. Alright, Paige, where you at? Yes, yeah, so what we'll actually do is we're going to kind of, kind of finish off the, uh, the place here. We'll kind of finish off the requests too. Um, then, we should do the beautiful honor of uh, plowing Paige. Uh, <laughs> maybe not that. No, um, we'll have a little kind of, I'll show you how the fishing function works. Then I might give it a little bit of a grind off screen. And then next episode, we'll actually go against Dran. Uh, well, uh, I mean, we'll talk to Dran. Spoiler alert slightly. Anyway, <laughs> sorry about that. I really should probably shouldn't have mentioned that. Um... Or maybe I'll mute this entire thing, and you'll never know what just then said. Let's depend how good I am in post-production. Anyway, so Paige isn't here. We'll quickly have a look for our side. Anyway, but no, um, basically what I was trying to say is we'll kind of like do some finishing off stuff here, and then we'll go and uh, do the final boss in the next episode. Anyway, Paige, hello. Booker, oh, you're alive. I was worried, thinking something bad happened to you because of me. But thank goodness you're okay, Paige. Show me your forgiveness. Anyway, <laughs> um, tell me how to, re how to rebuild your house. Um, don't forget a lamp. It's scary at night without a lamp. Really? All this time? A lamp? Your dad could have told me about a lamp? What happened to your mum as well? Your mum's like disappeared as well. Anyway, okay. Uh, young Paige, is there anything you've left for me outside? A chest with your knickers in? <laughs> that was really creepy. No, okay, I, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. Okay. Hello, family. I live here now. <laughs> Booker. 
Hey, Bay, how you doing? By the way, I don't ever use the word Bay in like an actual normal term. Um, good to see you. Uh, good to see you. What a strange way. Uh, I've made you a new pouch. Oh, sick. Nice. She gave me a po- she, gave me she gives me a pocket. It's for you. That's generally quite cool. Thank you very much for that. Wait, does this, does this do something else? There, done. Looks like you can carry a lot of items now, huh? Oh, okay, it was 60 before 100 Okay, sweet. I, I got panicked there. I was, like, I was like, wait, wasn't it 70 before? Anyway, um, okay, I wish you luck, Booker. Go for it. Nice. That's very quaint, that was. So pockets remind me of you now, after all the other pockets I pick up in the future. It sounds like a whore annotation that does, doesn't it? Ah, oh, you're the only woman for me until I pick up all the other women and completely utterly forget about you. <laughs> okay, that's not actually an annotation of my actual life, by the way. Um, okay. Sure, how should I rebuild Nolan? Uh, hmm, I don't know. You better ask my dad about that. Okay. I'm pretty sure he wants to be near the fishing place, so I think he wants to be near the pond. I'm not too sure. We'll sort all that afterwards anyway, so we'll finish off the other house nexty next. Okay, so... Uh, Laura's house. Okay. Auntie Laura. Is she actually my auntie, though? Or is this some kind of, like, incestuous village or something like that? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> hmm. I wonder what the two items are missing here. They're not to, to, completely to the right to me just here or anything, are they? Hmm. <laughs> anyway. Um. Laura's house. Where the frick did I put Laura's house? Is it over here? Yes, that's the one, isn't it? Yeah. Hello, Laura. Wait. Hey. Hey, kid. Hey, kid. Come back here. <laughs> oh, Booker. I found you. How come you don't play with me anymore? That's... Kind of creepy the way I said it. How come you don't play with me anymore? Hmm. Okay, Gina. Um, tell me how to rebuild your house. I don't know why I said that in a song. Don't forget Gina's tricycle. Put it outside of the house, please. Why do you, you talk to yourself in third person? That's, that's kind of creepy. At the same time, kind of cute. Okay. Uh, good, sweet, perfect. Okay. Uh, speed two, beautiful. All right. Laura. Laura, where are you? I'm your dead uh, nephew. I'm trying to think of what a, a, a son is to. Hey, there you are. You got a lot of sweet shit in your place. Nice. Hey, Laura. Oh, it's you, Booker. How did you make it? Wait, were you stuck inside of the, inside that strange bubble too? No, I released you, fat bitch. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I love how he never explains to people that he actually is re rebuilding the town. He's just sort of like they ask him the questions, he just responds in blankness. Anyway, um, tell me how to rebuild your house. Um, we have a lot of stuff around the house. I'd like a storage cabin for storing the clutter. Sick. Alright. Farewell, young Laura. And the suspense is building up there. Okay, uh, config assembly. Uh, do, do, do. Tricycle. I want to ride my tricycle. I want to ride my bike. Okay. And we are good. Nice. That's a freaking sweet ass looking tricycle. Look at that. <laughs> Look at them hexagonal wheels. <laughs> They're like, can we do circles in this tricycle? Like, ah, just save the 20 bucks and don't do it. <laughs> I love the swivel. That's terrifying. That's fucking terrifying. That is. Okay. Oh, Booker. Oh, Booker. Look. Look. Gina's house. It's back to normal. Impressive. I thought you were only a kid, and now look at you. Is that- are you, are you coming on to me, Gina? Please don't. Um, I'll cook for you today. Please stay with us for a meal. Here, take this for you, Booker. Oh, that's generally really nice. Thank you, Gina. Isn't this pretty? If you keep this, your body will become light. Uh, set it to act- oh my god, really? Set it to- <laughs> I love the way they missed the space as well. Set it to active item and <laughs> bring your cursor over it. Um, hold down the square as you move and you can move faster. This way, you, uh, even mum won't be able to catch you. Ah, little Gina. That actually might explain why she's like flying around outside before. Anyway, okay. Gina, let me steal your shit. Or Laura, sorry, and Gina as well, technically. Okay. Nothing else would be nice. I, I find it's quite quaint. I don't know why. I find it quite quaint that it's like quite a modern looking place. Like the sheets are very bright and stuff like that. But they live in the same room. And like in a big studio kind of place. I, I don't know why. It's just quite cute and not like even upsetting if that makes sense. You'd think it'd be quite depressing having the same like room. But I don't know why. It's generally quite cute. Anyway. So how should I rebuild Nolan? Um, the lousy mayor is out of ours. He's always filling with uh, with machines in his house. I can't stand the noise from his house. I'd appreciate it if <laughs> If you can place our house uh, away from the mayor's house. Okay. I love how I put it like her house is the closest to the mayor's house right now as well. Okay. Sweep. So. Okay. Taking that into account. 
Uh, Alright, so yeah, so uh, basically what I'm going to do now, guys and gals, we're going to basically move everyone's house and stuff to basically like fit what everyone wants. So, I think in an ideal world, Laura's house should probably pro mainly go to uh, basically Paige's house. So, Paige, do you have any requests at all to what you want me to do to your house at all? Paige? Okay. Oh yeah, I think he wants to be near the... Oh, for God's sake, where are they? Uh, <laughs> Paige. Okay. Uh, how should I rebuild Nolan? Hmm, I don't know. Ah, yeah, of course, yep. Yeah. Okay. Cheers, Paige. You know what? I, I don't know why I loved you. <laughs> okay. Mr. Pike. Mr. Pike, are you out here? There we are. Hello. Alright. Um, how should I rebuild Nolan? Um, you know I like fishing, don't you? <laughs> of course, yep. I kind of grasped that. Alright. Uh, move and remove. Okay, so... Let's move my house next to this for now. We'll call this like a temporary retreat. We'll pop good old Paige's house right over here next to the fishing place. I think it makes sense for the fishing place to be kind of in the like over there a little bit. Uh, Laura's house, you can come wander over there. Your house fits perfectly right there. I know Camacho is happy. I assume Gaffer is happy because I know he wants to be surrounded by places. I know Hag wants to be near the Dran's windmill. Uh, okay, and I know she wants to be away from the thing. What are we, how are we doing on stats? 75, nice, sweet, 75%, okay. I'm going to assume that Gaffers is done. I think Hags is definitely not done. So if we uh, move and remove, we'll pop you. I'm hoping she doesn't have an issue staying in the mayor at all. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Um, Alna wants to be away from them so they, they can have their own little kind of community over here. Um, does my mum have a preference on tool? Um... Mother, tell me where you want the house to go. How should I rebuild Nolan? Um, oh, oh, nice. Thank you, Booker. Now the sun tells me it's morning. Oh, okay. Oh, so you can actually confirm with them if you've done it or not. Sweet. Okay, that's pretty awesome. Okay, let's uh, just double check with these guys that we're actually okay. I didn't actually think that was a thing. I for some reason thought they actually kept telling me. Because I'm pretty sure when I did like Camacho's and Macho's thing, they like just kept telling me about it. Okay. Okay, that's fine. They're done. Sweet, so Paige is all, uh, Laura, was it? I think that was Laura I spoke to, I'm not too sure. Oh, okay. Adventure day five, night. Time to raid this bitch. <laughs> Start burning everyone's houses down. You thought the dark genie was bad. Okay, um, sweet, so he's happy, they're happy. Mama is happy because I can, she's facing the right way, don't really know how that works. Um... I f I guess if she only wants to face a certain direction, I could do this. So, okay, pop that there. Gonna pop you here, because I know for a fact she wants to be next to the finger jig. So if I pop that there, her, like I've got a little road leading towards her. Um, if we move this... So she only wants to be facing this direction. So I could technically put this one anywhere. So I mean, well, anywhere there's room apparently. Um, which is <laughs> she's just like here. Uh, hey, actually, oh! Oh, okay, okay, okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay, um... Can I... I can... Ah, oh, yes. Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay, I've got, I've got an idea. I've got a freaking idea, fam. Okay, so if we, like, remove this as well, take this all out. Nice. Okay, I'm, I'm liking this idea. I'm liking it. Okay. Um... So, if we, like, move all this as well... I, I think Gaffer may be a bit, a bit of an issue now I'm doing this, but it's okay. So, um, okay, actually, if I put this here, I might be able to kill two birds with one stone. Like, here? That might count? Okay, so... Move... Uh, no, 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 no. Config assembly. If we... It's probably going to turn out half as cool as I want it to, but... Uh, let's pop a tree. Actually, there's no real point in having that road there. Um, no, config this... Ah, da, 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 da. Come on, come on. Okay, move and remove, Gal. I want to move this bit here, though. Okay. Uh, conflict assembly, river, hold back the river, let me look at you. I, I, I hope actually some of you guys actually know what that song is. I've sort of been saying it, just sort of as you do. Okay. Look how freaking awesome my house looks now. That's, that's the bomb. I don't give a shit about everyone else. Uh, okay. <laughs> how I live my life. I'm kidding, by the way. Um, okay. Let's have some trees blocking the back ridge, you know, from everyone, like, seeing my celebrity lifestyle. Um... Config and assembly. <laughs> I love if I just leave it like left it like this. Like the mums is there, like help me, Booker, help me. Okay. Um, to do a move and remove. Take that out. Uh, config assembly. Ru Only got four. That's a shame. Okay. Um, we'll do two here. Two. Oh, that's actually the perfect amount. Nice. Hey, look who has the coolest house in the world. Look what I've done for you, mum. And I the best. Okay. 
Please tell me I've got the right place. Nice. Okay. Um, now, how close do you want to be to people? Because I know... He oh, you're not the gaffer. Okay. Um... Oh, nice. Sweet. So he's actually all done as well. I actually thought he might not be too uh, close enough. Okay, so much is done. Laura's done. Claude is actually a really good point. Um, I don't... I've, I've actually generally no idea what his request is. Uh, I, I kind of want to put these somewhere as well. I just want to put these in front of the mayor's house. I don't know why, but I kind of want to just pop them here. Uh, are his, are his like, steps kind of come off the... That's all right. Um... Should we have the little... Yeah, let's have the little windmills next to it. That sounds good. I like that. It sounds cute. It sounds a little cutie. Okay. Uh, I'll pop this. Just... I don't know. Where should we put it? It's like by itself. I don't want to... Uh, let's put it here. Let's put, right there. There you go. That looks, that looks pretty damn cool. Um, okay. So... I kind of want to... I don't know why, but I kind of want to move these guys forwards a little bit and just sort of do this. Actually, I like the... I'm probably, like, reducing... Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Let's, let's, let's stick with let's stick with what we're doing. So if we just move everyone's back, I just kind of want to make sure I'm not doing anything wrong. Okay, so they're fine there. How are we doing dramatics? Da, da, da. So it's still 75%, so I, I can imagine the majority of people were fine with what I was doing before. Okay. Uh, I don't know what... I, I honestly don't know what Cloud's one is. Okay. Wait, does he want to face a certain way? Is it so he can sleep during the day? I, don't, I, I think that's what it is. I don't finish doing uh, Let's see. A place uh, for a house. Uh, I'd like to... I'd like it where I can smell good food. Oh, so he wants to be... Oh, for fudge's sake. So he wants to be, like, over there. Uh, okay. Fucking... Of course. Of course. Cloud, the guy that was asleep on me for about half the game, has decided that he wants to be over near Alma's. Um... I'll tell you what, me and my man Cloud have actually got kind of close. So I'll tell you what, he's going to come, he's going to, he's going to have a personal access to my house. And be sat right in front of the, oh, actually we'll spin you around a little bit. Come on. Uh, that should fit there. You, you, do you not just like, what? Why does that not work that way? Oh, okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, bridge there, so you can get to my house if you like to, for some bizarre reason. Okay. Uh, let's pop some bridges on, like, I have a corner, make it all look fancy. And I'll pop, like, a double bridge. You put a double bridge in front of Claude, just in case he decides to go, you know, just in case one breaks for, because, because of his weight problem. Um, <laughs> that's not really fucking offensive, that did. Okay, um, we'll pop a river... I don't even know, just over here somewhere? Sure, I don't really know. Uh, let's just pop these here as well. I do quite like the trees being here. I don't know why. Um, anything else to place down? I'm happy with that. I think they're happy with that. 80 some cents. So, I know Gaff is happy. I know Matthew is happy. I know Laura's happy. Is Laura happy? Wait, what was Laura's again? Oh, oh Laura wanted to be away from uh, the mayor, wasn't it? Yeah, of course, yeah. Okay, if we just remove this quick sunlight, I'd be in there. Um... Sorry, let me ponder for a sec. I am pondering. I am pondering. I've got one piece of road left. I want to place that down. Uh, that look odd there. I can't like, place it there. I, I kind of want to have it like a... There... That'll do. That's fine. <laughs> okay. Um, anyway, so yeah. So uh, I know Mum's happy. <laughs> Looks like Mum's like the queen of the town. Okay, so um, Paige is happy. The windmill, I'm guessing, is happy. I, I assume so. Um, Hag is happy. Alan is happy. Cloud is happy. Sweet. So, um, yes, yeah, so if you guys and guys are wondering exactly, uh, actually, does the mayor have any preference on how I rebuild the town? I don't believe he does. Wait, does he? He better knocks. I mean, he, he's fucking stinged out of me. He better not have any a preference on where I put everyone else. He's like, well, I don't want anyone near me, please, because I am way too posh and royal for you guys. Okay. Uh, mayor. Yeah, I, I, I know you. Okay, okay, so you're just gonna rub it in my face more you're not giving me any supplies anymore? Cheers, buddy. Okay. Pop in here. Nothing there. Sweet. Um. Oakley dokely. So. <laughs> Oakley dokely. Um. Okay, yeah, I'm pretty happy. So I was gonna basically explain that. I just want to make sure it wasn't the mayor's last thing left. Um, the only actual last thing I actually have to do is actually finish the level, I believe. Um, I'm not sure if this actually applies for every single one in the future as well. Every single, uh, what's it called? Um, every other, how, how do I word it? Every, every village is basically the same like this, but I'm pretty sure this is how this one works. Um, it will become clear basically at the end of when 
when we basically get the reward for getting the request right, it'll become clear as to why we had to wait for this long, basically for finishing the thing. Um, but yeah, so anyway, ladies and gentlemen, so this has been it for this episode of Dark Cloud. I hope you guys and gals have enjoyed it. I'm sorry for like the very longer episodes recently. I've been kind of like plowing on a little bit. I've been basically just plowing through the levels quite quickly and um, kind of getting away with myself. But I've been really enjoying the playing this game for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy it as well. And anyway, ladies and gentlemen, if you guys and gals want to check out more, more content, there's a link in the description below to check out all of my playlists. If you guys and gals have a quick gander, there's more than stuff there to, for you guys and gals to keep yourself more than entertained. Once again, I'll be on some and once again, you guys are beautiful. Ask ever. Say la vie, hasta vista, and goodbye. Watch out!